Welcome to Mr. Beck Does Your Homework. This is AP Physics, homework number 2.1, question number 3. It says, a car traveling in a straight line has a velocity of 5.42 meters per second at some instant. After 5.48 second, its velocity is 12.6 meters per second. What is its average acceleration in this time interval? Answer in units of meters per second squared. Well, let me write down what I know. It says a car traveling in a straight line has a velocity of 5.42 meters per second. That is going to be my initial velocity. That's the velocity that it's starting at. So I'm going to put V0 equals 5.42 meters per second. I use V0 for my first velocity. After 5.48 seconds, well, that's a time, equals 5.48 seconds. Its velocity is 12.6 meters per second. Well, that's a new velocity, so that's going to be v equals 12.6 meters per second. What is its average acceleration in this time interval? Well, I have an equation for acceleration, and I know that my acceleration is going to be my change in velocity divided by my time. Delta meaning change in how much did my velocity change. Another way to write that is that it's going to be my final velocity minus my initial velocity divided by how much time has passed. In this case, my acceleration is going to be my final velocity v. That's 12.6 meters per second minus my initial velocity v0 is 5.42 meters per second. divided by my time of 5.48 seconds. Now this will give me a meters per second on the top divided by seconds on the bottom. So that's meters divided by seconds again divided by seconds. That's going to give me an acceleration of some number. Remember do your order of operations. So subtract these two, hit enter, and then divide by this and you will wind up with some number and then the units will be meters divided by seconds divided by seconds again, which gives us meters per second squared. 